Okay, so I don't know what I'm going to be for Halloween. have no clue. And Walmart is not helping me any. Because they don't have any costumes for adults this year. They only have children's costumes. Far as I can tell. Far as I've seen. I have not seen any adult costumes. So. And I don't know what I'm going to be. No clue. So I'm just going to have to wing it and come up with something at the house, I guess. I don't know. Unless I find something at the dollar store or resale shop or something. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. So we watched Mary Shelley's Frankenstein from 1994, um, directed by K Kenneth Branagh, um, who also played Victor. Um, this also stars Robert De Niro. He plays the creature, and you have Helena Bonham Carter. She plays Elizabeth. Um, Tom Holtz, Holtz, I don't know, I don't know how you pronounce it, plays Henry, Aiden Quinn is Walton, and Ian Holm is Victor's father, and there were some other actors and actresses. I hate pronouncing names, I always get them wrong, and even names I do know. For some reason, I say I'm wrong. Because I just go with the flow. And I, I, I don't know. <laughs> so, I've never read the book. So, I think after watching all these movies, I need to read the book. Um, this one, I think, I heard it said that this one follows the book more closely. Um, so, I'm going to have to read the book. This movie was good. Tell me why I liked it. I don't know. I did. I did. Um, it's very dramatic. Very melodramatic. It's very over the top. The acting is over the top. Um, I think Robert De Niro does such a good job as the creature. And I was wondering what character he was playing. Because I, I did not know. And then he had turned out to be in the creature. And I'm like... Oh my gosh, this is Robert De Niro, and I could never fathom that, but there he was, and I'm like, oh my gosh, and it was awesome, and him, like, like, learning how to say things, pronounce words, and read, and all this kind of stuff was very interesting, and I enjoyed that part of it. I very much felt sorry for him a lot. I felt sorry for everybody a lot in this movie, but it was so good. I mean, I don't know why it was just good to me. I don't know. It was it was good. Um, <laughs> yeah, so I, I pretty much liked the characters. Um, Victor and Elizabeth being brother and sister, but I guess not really brother and sister, not related, blood related, I guess. And them getting together was kind of weird, but that's, you know, how it was. And that's still how it is for some people these days. Um, there's a lot of things in life that are just kind of weird. Uh, but that was weird, but it was, I guess it was good. But the, oh, it was so tragic. Ooh, the story is just so tragic. It's so much drama. It's just tragedy. And it's just, tell me why I like it, but... But, um, I do hate the sad endings in this, once again, sad ending. But I, I did pretty, pretty much enjoy this. Um, I think we have another Frankenstein movie we're watching. Um, and yeah, so this is Halloween. Uh, I like, I'm, I need to watch all the Frankenstein movies. Just all of them, because... This is good! This is good! This is good stuff. Okay, until the next time. 
Um, there's probably so much I could have said about this movie. I mean, the atmosphere was just awesome at parts, and and it was it was gross at times. It was sad at times. It was funny at times. It was everything at everything, everything, just everything. So I enjoyed it. Alrighty. <laughs>